I'm Rainbow Johnson. I'm a doctor, a wife, and a mother to five beautiful children. But as I watched them grow into the people they are today, I realized they don't know my story. You grew up in a cult. It's amazing I ever met you. Well, we actually wouldn't have ever met if the elders hadn't gotten arrested. Wait, what? Well, they didn't get arrested. They got um, detained for three to five years. What? what? In the summer of 1985, I was 12 years old, and I was living with my family on a commune. We ate together, prayed together, and even slept together. I would have told you it was perfect. But the government would have told you we were a radicalized cult in violation of over 47 ATF regulations. My peaceful little world had been taken away. When are we going back home? This is our new home. What? Hey, hippies. Harrison Jackson III was my grandfather. I'm going to make more real-world money to pay for this real-world house that your entire family's survival is dependent upon. <laughs> and that is why I hate guns. My little brother, Johan, looked at everything like one great big magical adventure. My little sister, Santa Monica, complained like a woman with no kids on her third divorce which interestingly enough, she would eventually become. And when we got to school, we got introduced to the real world. I'm too little to die! Real quick. What are you weirdos mixed with? What's mixed? <laughs> My parents had sent us out into the world with absolutely no warning that being mixed was even a thing. Imagine being the new kid when no one in the world is like you. But you have to understand, today's mixed kids can look up to rappers, ballerinas, athletes, a president, and a princess. The only heroes we had were DeBarge. Feel the beat of the rhythm of the night. You don't have to worry what those other kids think. They're idiots. And I want to be one of them. I want to be an idiot so bad. Tell me you didn't send these babies to school looking like this. The world smacked you in the face today, didn't it? You can tell me. It did. It really did. They watched TV for one night, and now this is who they think they are. What you talking about, Rainbow? We are living in a material world, and I am a material girl. In the summer of 1985, I was 12 years old. <laughs> Anybody get my hair wet, and we fight. <laughs> and my life changed forever. <laughs> 